So Kyle Ramsey will put his foot into it, and this will be blasted into the end zone and out to the 25-yard line. And here comes this raging Cajun offense. Neil Johnson goes in motion, sets up on that right side of the line. They'll spin to the wide side of the field. Fields throws on the run, pass is caught. Near the 36-yard line by Errol Rogers. Picks up 13 more yards. Really nice design here. They want to hit the back in the flat, but he goes to the second level, and you can't throw a football any better there than Chandler Fields does. And Earl Rogers is running that deep out, able to come. Tenth play of this drive coming up. It's a big one on fourth down. They'll bootleg it to the wide side. Fields will throw back over the middle. Pass is caught down around the 20-yard line, and that one goes to Johnny Lumpkin. Dave, this is a really nice job by Chandler Fields. He wants to go in the flat, and there are three guys covering it. Trying to dial something up here on third and goal. Fields looking to throw. Pocket collapses. Dodges one defender, two defenders. Coming near side, throws to the back of the end zone. It's caught. Touchdown, Louisiana. What a grab from Johnny Lumpkin if it holds. Take another look at it, but this I think Lumpkin does get one foot down, and you can see it right there at the end zone. He does get one foot down, a nice job. This is what we were talking about earlier, Dave, with Chandler Fields just being able to avoid pressure. And originally, it came off the right side. A four man look from the Cougars. Fields will throw over the middle, throws a bullet across the middle, and it's caught around the 30 yard line. Thrown it twice to this point as they look at a second down and six. A little razzle-dazzle. Toon stays on his feet and finally dropped back at the 45-yard line. We'll take another look at it, and you talk about just being able to, it's going to be a reverse pass, but they lost on the edge. And once that happened, it, the, everything just breaks down, and he was never able. Out of the hold of Dalen Cambry. Execution looks good. Let's see if the kick is good, and it is. A flag is down, however. The punt from Lane Wilkins. Good clean snap. Kick is on the way, and it's a line drop taken at the 40. No fair catch called. Garrett turns the corner, and boy, that will be a short field for Louisiana after the nice return. Fair catch here. Yeah, I thought it was. I mean, because you talk about just being able to get down there uh, quickly, the lone snapper, but, you know, the, the Gunners do an outstanding job uh, on the edge as well, and that's them being able to block, block, you know, you talk about that outside guy to the edge. And so the lone snapper, he's just got to come to balance a lot quicker. And so he slowed down like he thought he was going to fair catch it, and he never even was able to make a play on it. And so that's a tough one when you look at it. Almondaris, who hit from 42, and guess what? This one's from 42, just more in the center of the field. Kick is on the way, and this one is belted through the uprights again. So another three on the board. Seven and a half sacks this year. Toon on the run. Pass is caught. And out of bounds goes Carter, but he picks up the first down. They'll spot him back at the 32-yard line. Day for Houston, 32 yards. Yeah, and I love what they do as far as moving the quarterback right here. And you just have a deep corner route, and you're trying to rob underneath on it. That's Trahan that tried to make that play. Carter's able to keep his eyes focused on the football, and he steps out of bounds, or that would have been a touchdown. Second down. Going to throw. Boy, has time. Going down the middle, looking for the touchdown. The Cougars are on the board, 33 yards. Keyshawn Carter. Had it. We'll take another look at it. We'll play action, and I mean, he just splits it. And the defenders for Louisiana, I don't know if they didn't think that the quarterback could get it there, but I mean, both of those guys. Here comes Smith around the right side. He's out to the 25-yard line. That'll be a first down. Caesar thought he had a tackle for a moment. And yeah, you see Smith is used a little track and field hurtling over, going low. And nice job, Emery trying to. Over the middle, pass is caught. Nice catch there from Lance Lejean. Did out of playing today to get ready for the draft. And here's a guy that's. 
Fields looking to throw. Has a man down around the 15 to the 12-yard line. That'll get another Louisiana first down. The third and final. It'll be 30 seconds. Boy, just mass confusion on these timeouts, but I thought they had one left, and they do, so. Almendares, he's hit from 42 twice, and this one is blasted through the uprights as well. On first down and 10, they'll keep it on the ground in a big hole right between the guards as Henry picks up 12 yards and a good start for the Cougars, and you can hear three tight ends set for the Cougars on first down and goal. Henry stays in the game at running back. They'll fake it to him. Toon looking to throw. Over the middle, the back of the end zone. Touchdown. Tank Dell with another one. That's number 16 on the year. Take another look at it, Dave. And it, he, he really just wins at the line of scrimmage. You know, he's probably open. Amos is covering him. Lose football. The Cougars have it. Chris Smith, I don't know if it was a clean handoff or not, but the ball hit the turf immediately. And Cedric Williams comes up with the recovery, and the Cougars are in business. With the penetration right there that he was able to get, he not only knocked it out of Chris Smith's hand, but he's able to cover the fumble. And so from a defensive standpoint, that's almost, you know, just like coming up with a strip sack. Tune couldn't get out of trouble. He'll be dropped back at the 13-yard line. Here's another look at that sack. Zion Hill Green with that pressure and Peterson right there at the edge. Oh. Low snap. This time they'll hand it off to Chris Smith and he fumbled the football and Houston has it. Yeah, just looking at it. And He's got to squeeze that football, and nice job. Muton comes up with the recovery, but it popped out by Jamal Morse. Three of their games have gone to overtime this year. A long way to go. Clayton Toon keeps it, has a lot of room off the left side. Toon to the 30. Four yards. Well, nice job of the counter, the QB counter play, and you have your tailback that's leading up, and Henry does a nice job of just finishing it at the end. But we talked about coming into how uh, Clayton Toon. Toon lofts it up, has a man caught, caught by Carter. First down inside Houston territory. They're going to spot the ball. Just taking another look at it, you know, it, you're rushing four, but right away, that was the number three guy in Carter. He's just able to beat, get over the top. And three timeouts, Louisiana with their three timeouts. Off the left side goes Henry. He'll be inside the 30 down to the 27 yard line. Tune. Has some blockers out in front to the 15, down to the 11-yard line. Pass is caught. Touchdown, Houston, and who else? But Nathaniel Tank Dell. He's got off coverage, and he's just running a quick out and able to make a guy miss, and he's able to score, but the official... <laughs> On the edge, he didn't call a touchdown immediately, so Louisiana picks up the ball. 23-16, Houston rallies. Trailed by 10 at halftime, and they win it by 7. They finish the year 8-5. and five. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.